Alright, so I got the skulls where I want it, and now we're just going to kind of blend them into the base. I'm going to add some shadows around the edges and try to, you know, cause it's almost like they're together in a way, so I kind of want to just bring it out a little bit more. And then uh, once that's done, just uh, finish up with some touch-ups, and she's almost ready to go. Alright guys, so pretty much all done. Uh, I like the way it came out. I had some fun doing it. Hopefully it gives you guys a cool idea and you know how I work and you know stuff to come up with. So as you can see with the skulls is I added the greens in there. Um, I also had you know did some dry brushing with the pearlized green on my finger. So it gives a little bit of like a, a tint on the skulls that there is some greens there instead of just doing the cracks and that's it. It's just having fun with it, just playing with it, building it up. So as you can see, I put the pearls in all the deep areas. Um, just makes it pop a little bit more. It gives you that idea that it's definitely, you know, Wonder Woman uh, killed a couple green lanterns. And, uh, you know, the lantern being lit on the base, you get some colors here and there. You know, it hits the skulls a little bit more. Um, and even if you turn it off, let's see. Turn it off. You just can't have it on all the time. But, you know, so you still get the idea that, you know, it's there. And uh, it was a lot of fun. 
Uh, the base came out pretty cool. Like I said, I might do some touch-ups here and there, but I really don't think so. I'm kind of happy where it's at. This is kind of what I envisioned when I sculpted the whole thing. I had the idea in my head. Uh, you know, Wonder Woman at her homeland, Themyscira. Um, basically, you know, the pillars would be more like this than what Sideshow sent us, which was very gray and dirty and, like, broke, you know. I, I would envision that, you know, at least when you see it in the comics, it's always clean. It's uh, It's very you know, pretty, it's very, you know, it's just lively, it's not like run down, broken, but I figure, you know, if she's there and she breaks a pillar, you know, that's a fresh pillar that's clean, this is kind of what it would look like, and I don't know, I just had some fun with it, so all the cracks are popping out more, you know, we see a lot more of this stuff here, um, I had a little bit of, uh, I did some, uh, fine tuning, uh, before when I was, uh, flat coating it, and I mixed up some stuff where it kind of splurted out with the flat coat. And it gave a little bit more of texture in some areas, like a little bit of dust. So that worked out pretty cool. And then, uh, that's pretty much it. So hopefully you guys liked the way it came out and had a lot of fun doing it. And be sure to check out the final uh, 360 video of the whole custom. Thanks for watching and we'll be back with more videos.